Now we're going to look at the elements of game design. Those aspects that you need to consider in your own development of computer games, but also that you should have an understanding of and be aware of when you're selecting the use of computer games as educational tools. So there are a range of fundamental elements. The first is storytelling. The vast majority of games have a strong narrative aspect and you need to consider your own narrative aspect that you will weave into your computer game. Then there's a challenge and reward based system. What makes the game drive your actions forward towards some form of achievement or recognition of progress? So think about how you're going to incorporate a challenge and reward based process within your game. There is an aspect of feedback loops where your choices, your decisions, your activity within the game provide you feedback on how you can improve and advance within that game. So there are things that you're going to learn, things that you will do, maybe objects you will collect that will then allow you to progress within the game space. And finally, there's a concept of player engagement. How do we engage players with your game so that they're going to want to continue playing it, but also potentially replay it and share their enjoyment with others and encourage them to play it? But all of those aspects around engaging your players with the game that you create. So think about those as fundamental elements. Now, I've given you some examples of some games that you may be familiar with. Uh, Minecraft, Kerbal's Space Program, and Code Combat. And so have a look at these games and how they've incorporated those game elements into their design of their games. And that will then help you contextualize your own use of those game design elements in the game you develop. And see if you can identify another game and the elements within that game. So how it's got an educational value and the impact that it has from playing the game and share that as an example onto Teams. So similar to the examples I've provided you with you with those three, think about another game and how you can identify the game elements, the educational values and the impact of that game.